The presidential candidates face the cameras for the third and final live debate. The economy is the theme, and first up is reformer Ishak Jahangiri. Domestic production uh, has some problems. One of them is the smuggling of goods. The smuggling of goods uh, is done always by those who want to use this method in order to harm local production. Conservative Mustafa Mir Salim called his words empty, saying he had no plan. First, what's your plan? Then you can criticize others. You, should, you cannot just have a slogan and then say, Ms. Reis, here others have no programs. President Hassan Rouhani promised to crack down on smuggling and boost domestic productivity if he wins re-election. We should focus on the root causes of the problem and uh, how does the smuggling take place in case of boosting the quality of the, the domestically produced products and if we can uh, produce these products with a cheaper price, then there will be no smuggling. Conservative Ibrahim Raisi said Iran relied on oil revenues too much and tax should be the bedrock of the economy. Uh, you see people rely on tax in the other world, world countries, but uh, in fact uh, there are people who evade taxation and there are individuals who uh, enter hundreds of uh, containers. How come no measure is taken against them? Mustafa Hashemi Daba is a reformist and says investment in quality is the key to economic growth. We need to have, we need to produce the best quality products. That means our production should be export oriented. It was down to the mayor of Tehran, Mohammad Ghalibaf, to provide some drama, who reacted to accusations that he was corrupt, leveled at him by Ishak Jahangiri. The points that Mr. Jahangiri mentioned in this issue, they are blatant lies, and this should be looked into. He said $2,200 billion in properties that has been stolen. This is a big slander. He, I hope he can prove that. The World Bank says the second biggest economy in the Middle East faces challenges. They include inflation, unemployment and lack of consumer goods because of sanctions. Voters make their choice on May 19th. Imran Khan, Al Jazeera.